Welcome to Videos by Jeff Sibelius. In this quick tip episode, I'll demonstrate how to hand catch your Q500 and Typhoon H drones. This quick tip is part of a series of videos to help you learn how to fly your Q500 and Typhoon H drones. This episode applies to all Q500s and the Typhoon H. Let's get started on unique quick tip, how to hand catch your drone. Landing your aircraft on the ground is normally the safest way to end your flight, but there are times when this just isn't the case. If you're standing in tall grass, the aircraft won't reach the ground before the propellers get caught in the grass. On rugged or uneven ground, the aircraft can easily tip over while trying to land. You should also avoid landing on gravel or on muddy or wet areas. Here's one of my flights where landing was literally impossible. I was able to launch from the back of the boat, but there was no way to bring my Q500 down to the deck and land it. As you develop your flying skills, practicing the technique of hand catching your drone will prepare you for flying in new environments and situations. The process of hand catching is similar for the Typhoon H and Q500. Regardless which drone you're flying, you must use caution when grabbing it in the air. Don't grab the aircraft on its motor arms or body as this will put your hands too close to the spinning propellers. And you definitely don't want to grab the camera or gimbal. The gimbal assembly will simply break in your hand. Grab the drone on a lower, sturdy portion of the landing gear and keep it at arm's length, above head level, until the motors have come to a complete stop. All that said, here's how to hand catch the Typhoon H. Hover the aircraft just above head level so you can reach it. Watch the aircraft for a moment to make sure it's hovering in place and not drifting. Hold the transmitter in your left hand with the thumb near the red button. Reach up with the right hand and grab a landing gear leg at the point of the T intersection. Now press and hold the red button to stop the motors. Then you can bring down the aircraft down to the ground where you can shut off power on the drone, then the transmitter. Here's how to hand catch the Q500. Hover the aircraft at head level or just above so you can reach it. Watch the aircraft for a moment to make sure it's hovering in place and not drifting. The Q500 tends to drift while hovering, so use caution here. Hold the transmitter in your left hand with the thumb near the red button. Reach up with the right hand and grab a landing gear leg at the point of the T intersection. Now press and hold the red button to stop the motors. In a couple of seconds, the motors will stop and then you can bring the aircraft down to the ground where you can shut off power on the drone, then the transmitter. Practice hand catching your aircraft in low winds and on open ground until you're comfortable with the process. Then, when you find yourself in a poor landing situation, you'll be glad you know how to retrieve your aircraft safely. I hope you enjoyed this unique quick tip. Links to a playlist with more unique training videos is on screen so be sure to check them out. Please like and subscribe so I can release more unique training videos and post your requests for things that you want covered in the comments below. Thanks for watching.